Kirkland Signature Golf Balls. We're not talking about just any regular Kirkland golf ball. We're talking about the neon yellow golf ball. Ever since these came out, I have been so curious about how they perform. I'm guessing they perform just as well as the white ones, but I wanted to try them out myself. But not only just myself, but I actually just recently with a friend, Edgar, him and I were able to play an 18 hole round of golf using just the Kirkland balls. And so I thought it might be helpful for us to kind of tell you about like our takes and our review on these performance balls. You're gonna to wanna to watch to the end of the video because I have one thought for Kirkland. Let me just say, man, these Kirkland balls, we were smacking these on the fairway. I don't know what our percentage was, but hitting it off our big stick, man, it felt really nice. We were hitting fairways just dead on. Not bad, we got on a fair with. One of the things that Edgar did mention was that he uses a big Bertha driver, and every time he'd hit these, he would say something about, here, just listen to what he has to say. So the first thing I noticed was the sound of the ball that's coming off my driver. It's very pingy. That would be the word for me. You know, the pink driver sound with any ball, that's kind of what I'm getting off this ball. And see what I face at least a lot softer, I think. But, uh, yeah, that's my first initial thoughts off my driver. At least for me, hitting these off of my Sim 2 driver, oh, they felt so good. It just sounded so sweet. I'll tell you, it made you wanna just hit these more and more over and over again. Man. Great shot. The balls are more budget friendly. I don't know about you, but sometimes when you just tee it up, you just it's you just want one less thing to worry about. You don't want to think about oh I'm gonna lose it, I'm gonna lose another ball or anything. I feel like when because of the cost of this this Kirkland ball, you're able to just tee it up and it's one less thing to worry about and you just swing freely. That's all that, that's probably why we were enjoying hitting these. All right, so now I wanna talk about the iron play of these, right? So hitting these off of my irons, personally for me, hitting them, it felt just as good as the, the driver. Uh, I think one thing I did notice was that my yardage was coming up a little bit shorter than usual. I'm not sure if that's because we're in fall ball, a little bit colder, so I'll kinda um, assume that's kinda the reason why from hitting my uh, nine iron all the way to my five iron. These felt very uh, crisp and very soft when you hit them. But unfortunately, we did have two errors that did cost two balls. Our first lost ball. <laughs> it's okay, we got a few more sleeves. Are you gonna drop from here or? No, 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 no freaking way. I mean, of course, losing a ball sucks, but the fact that he's only losing a Kirkland ball, it's kind of like, all right, we move on. We move on to the next player. Wedges and putting. So for short game, I'm gonna put these two together. So this is one of the things that I love about the neon golf. I feel like compared to the version two, the white ones, I feel like in terms of like the spin, uh, they improve so much more. I feel like they have a greater response, especially off of the, my wedges, the chip shots, chip and pitch shots. Um, and so that's one thing that, I, at least for me personally, that's what it feels, the feel of it just, I feel like there's more control over it. Oh. Uh, they were great out of the bunkers. We had a couple instances where we got the ball into the bunker. Take that. In terms of quality and just holding up, 
like this is a great example i don't know if you can see yeah they've got some dirt on there but overall the the ball like there aren't any scuff marks or anything it really held up well oh for putting you definitely want to have the right feel um, especially when it comes to distance control and I felt like I was putting really well with these I felt like it performed well especially coming off the face of the putter you want a good feel for it especially when it comes to distance control and I feel like this ball didn't shoot out or anything and it'll roll very nicely especially like I said with distance control it was on par no pun intended that was a lot of fun. Overall, I mean, for me, I like the Kirkham, Kirkham balls. Actually, they're no different from the white ones. Um, I felt like off the driver, off my irons, wedges, the putt, every, all around it felt good. I don't know what your thoughts. I like them. I, I like the way they felt. I like the way they, you know, it took some time to get used to the sound of it um, off my driver, but I hate those things for a week, so why not? My only one gripe about these is nothing. These are great. I love the yellow and white ones, so honestly, these are great. But if there's one thing, Kirkland, Kirkland, please release your Kirkland irons and driver sooner. Like, I am dying to test those out. I am dying to see them in person. I'm dying to try them out with these balls. That's my only thing. That would be great if you could just uh, release them faster. Before the holidays, that would be great. Anyways. Well, I appreciate you checking out this review, checking out me and Edgar hitting some of these neon balls and hearing us out. If you like this content, please, please subscribe and like. That would be awesome. This is a lot of fun for me. And until then, I'll talk to you guys later.